Hi all, I'm Dulcy here. So today I'm back with medical surgical nursing, dental urinary system. The topic is bladder cancer. So in the last two videos, we had discussed about kidney cancer, urethral cancer. So let's see what is the difference in bladder cancer. Bladder cancer refers to any several types of malignant growth of urinary bladder. The cell lining inside the bladder cells are almost likely to develop cancer. That means cancerous cells are seen in the bladder. Okay, that means uh, immature, easily multiplying cells are seen in the bladder, which is causing bladder cancer. There are three types of bladder cancer that is uh, urethro, sorry, squamous cell carcinoma, adeno cell carcinoma, uh, urethro cell carcinoma. Urethro cell carcinoma is only 90% uh, of people are seen. Squamous cell 3 to 8 percentage, adenocell 1 to 2 percentage. That means the rarest one is adenocell carcinoma. Then moving on to the etiology, idiopathic. The main causes idiopathic or the exact causes unknown. Smoking, age, uh, sex, family history of any bladder cancer or any exposure to chemotherapy or radiation therapy, or uh, then chronic bladder infection. Then chemotherapy drug side effects. For example, I can say one drug is cyclopromoside. Then, uh, so this all are the etiology. Carcinogen is also the carcinogen in urine. Carcinogen means cancer causing lead in the bladder. Okay, cancer causing agent which is seen in the bladder that is known as carcinogens. Okay, so carcinogen in urine will be seen. That is also a cause. So stages are same as kidney cancer, only changes in the location and the organ. Okay, so if you have any doubt in that, please go watch kidney cancer. Then you will be getting the stages and you will be understanding more about it. Okay, moving on to the clinical manifestation, there will be a gross hematuria. Now what is gross hematuria means? Hematuria, we know blood in urine, right? Gross hematuria means in your naked eyes, you can see that the blood is going in urine. Okay, then pain dysuria cystitis now if you don't know what is cystitis go back watch the video cystitis okay then polyuria prostate infection and all will be there in as a clinical manifestation then diagnostic evaluation same history collection physical examination urine analysis cystoscopy imaging tests such as ctmri and biopsy biopsy is a test through which we get a confirmed diagnosis that it's a bladder cancer Management depends upon the stage as well as the location and which all the cells are affected. Okay, radiation and chemotherapy will be given, hormonal th therapy, immunotherapy will be given for the patient. Surgical management, radical cystectomy, partial cystectomy in male standard surgical procedure is cystoprostectomy, that is removal of the bladder and prostate gland, okay, uh, which is commonly seen. But uh, bladder cancer is not more uh, seen in men, but is usually seen more in females. I hope you all understood about this. If there is any doubt, please get back to me. Thank you. Have a nice day.